Good morning. So I feel like I left you guys hanging yesterday. I got to standing there and got a bunk and just chilled for the rest of the night. There was a bonfire, there was soda. Um, I had some leftover pizza. It was just a good night. Got to sleep in a real bed and shower. So those are the simple things that you enjoy. Um, now I'm hiking. It's been a lot of uphill, very humid, very hot. I'm sweating and a little bit uncomfortable, but I'm at a water source right now. So I'm gonna filter my water. Today, I should see Max Patch, but it might start raining later. So I don't think I will tent on top like I did last year. Um, I don't know how great the view's gonna be. Um, and also today's kind of buggy. So I didn't really experience bugs on the AT last year, but there's a lot. So. Yesterday I got a bug stuck in my eye and this morning I swallowed a bug, so they're out there. So today is a little bit uncomfortable, but I'm just hiking slow, taking it easy, and now I'm going to get hydrated. I put in my first audiobook of the hike so far. It's a motivational book, Fail Until You Don't, so maybe that will help a little bit. Um, but yeah, really buggy. I'm going to filter my water quick and keep hiking. So standing bear, the bunks were only $25. They served breakfast burritos this morning, which were pretty filling for $7. And they have a small resupply with just snacks and nothing too crazy. But I ended up spending maybe like 14 bucks on a resupply there and found these little fudge <laughs> cookies or whatever they're called. So that's what I'm gonna have for my dessert, my breakfast dessert. <laughs> This is the summit of Snowbird Peak. And I believe there's a view on the other side of this funky looking thing. So I climbed about 2,400 feet of elevation for this view. I've just been <laughs> climbing and sweating all morning. Someone left a very well-made walking stick at this road crossing. That's pretty nice. So Max Patch is coming up in just one mile. Last year I camped on top of Max Patch, but that's not my plan this year. Uh, mostly because of the weather, it's probably gonna rain. Um, and I just had a really good experience with it last year, so I don't think I need to do it again. Plus, I think I'm gonna hike a little further than Max Patch. It's only two o'clock, so it's too early to end the day, in, in my opinion, for me.
All right, so I am approaching a shelter. I'm gonna stay there mostly because I think it's about to start to rain and I'd love to not set my tent up in the rain. Um, it's about 3.30, so I'm calling it a day pretty early, um, but I am excited to stay warm and dry inside my tent, get a lot of rest, eat a lot of food, and just feel revived. So that's the plan. And that's gonna make a 16 mile day um, and then tomorrow will probably be another 16 mile day into hot springs. So that's how I'm dividing that standing there to hot springs stretch. So I think that's going to work out pretty well. All right, just got my tent set up and then within seconds it started raining. So I'd say that's good timing. Now I'm just gonna get inside and chill. You know, it's not the flattest tent site. Um, I think I'm gonna be a little slanted when I sleep tonight, but I'm, I'm gonna make it work. At least, I'm, at least I'm dry right now. This is what I'm gonna use to have a little tent bath and clean up for tonight. So I did all of my camp chores. I ate dinner. I hung my food bag. I just blew up my mattress, set my quilt up. Now I'm just chilling. I am going to edit all of my videos because I am so behind and I probably have like six days of videos to edit, which will be cool because I can knock those out really fast and then when I'm in hot springs tomorrow, just post them all to YouTube. So I was nervous that I was getting really behind on YouTube for a second, but I think I'm going to get all caught up tonight. And this tent site is definitely really slanted, so I am not looking forward to trying to fall asleep. I feel like I'm going to be fidgeting all night, but it's raining and I just don't want to fix it. So since people ask me a lot um, how long it takes to edit the videos, I just edited all four days of the Smokies and it took about an hour and a half. Um, so now I'm just going to make the thumbnails to get that over with too and probably go to bed. It's only seven o'clock, it just got dark out. <laughs> All right, and another update, four thumbnails takes less than 10 minutes. <laughs> so it's like 7.15 right now. <laughs> All right, good night friends, I'll see you tomorrow.